Ashley Kane has candidly admitted Hess feeling slightly rattled and super nervous after revealing his baby daughter Isaiah's leukemia has reached the ex on the beach star, 30, shared an emotional update with fans on Instagram on Friday night, saying he needs to some time to sit and earlier in the day, the doting dad had taken his little girl, 6 months, to hospital for an appointment and revealed there is a new plan of action amid her cancer battle. Giving a late night update, Ashley said, I've let the girls go to bed and am staying up. Can't lie it's been the first time properly since it started I felt super secure like it's hitting me a bit and I haven't been rattled on his whole journey and I feel slightly rattled at the moment. Think I need some time to sit and reflect, pull myself together and reset for tomorrow. Head's gone a bit today, can't lie. Ashley had earlier shared sweet clips of him playing with his daughter after their trip to the hospital for an appointment. In one video the reality star looked every inch the doting dad as his adorable little girl lay sleeping on his chest with her hand resting on his cat. It had been a busy day for the family, with the star earlier reassuring fans had update them on Azalea's situation when we get our heads around it. Before telling his tiny daughter, Ashley documented their trip to hospital for an appointment, with Azalea looking sweet in her car seat, while he told her, Hello princess, off to hospital, aren't we? Let's go champ. You look amazing by the way. You look absolutely beautiful. After their appointment, the father of one asked his little girl, Shall we go back home now baby? Shall we have a play? Do you wanna have a kiss? Have a cuddle? Yay! Ashley then revealed, So, we've got a new plan of action now for Azalea. It's gonna take a bit of time to get our heads up but, we'll update you guys as soon as we've had a chill out, got our heads around it and we're ready to go then. In a heartwarming moment, the reality star turned to his daughter and said, Let's go, let's go champ. Nikolai. Nikolai. You've got this. Ashley was left in tears on Tuesday as he marked the moment his daughter Azalea left hospital to go home for the first time in five months. The reality star described it as a miracle blindsided by heartbreak after doctors delivered the news her leukemia had returned just 10 minutes before the family were due to leave the children. Azalea is battling a rare and aggressive form of leukemia and had recently undergone a stem cell transplant. Taking to Instagram, Ashley shared the moment of Azalea ringing the bell so he and his partner Safiya Borigi could finally take her home, with Azalea continuing her treatment as an outpatient. He penned, today was supposed to be a day of unquestionable happiness. However, it turned out like most days on this journey, a miracle blindsided by heartbreak. We got told a few days ago that Cecilia would be ringing the bell today and coming home with us, as a family to resume treatment two days per week as an outpatient. However, 10 minutes before the moment we have been praying for over the last five, we got urgently informed that Cecilia's leukemia had returned. Cancelled the celebration as we felt broken and numb to the core before seeing her beautiful face telling us, the show must go on and us then realizing how far our little girl has come and how much she deserves this moment. She has battled against the odds, she has overcome every obstacle in her path and she has done it all with remarkable spirit and the biggest smile on her face. For now we are enjoying precious moments at home until we return to hospital on Friday. Thank you for your support and please keep our beautiful daughter in your prayers. The moving video showed the corridor lined with nurses and doctors applauding the family as they prepared to go home. Through tears Ashley said, I want to say thank you for all the care you've given us. For looking after her but also just the care for us has been amazing. We got some news today that Azalea's leukemia has come back but that just means that we stay positive and we get back to ring that second bell and get out of here. The couple had faced an agonizing two-week wait to find out whether the stem cell transplant managed to clear out the leukemia from her bone marrow. Ashley said he was devastated to learn Azalea was at a higher risk of complications going into the transplant after her cancer returned, following two rounds of chemotherapy. When Azalea was diagnosed with leukemia she had a soaring white cell count of 200, and also had tumors on her lungs, kidneys, and stomach. What are the symptoms of leukemia in children? Fatigue and pale skin, this is because leukemia can cause anemia which makes a child feel weak, tired and lightheaded. Infections and fever, children with leukemia lack normal white blood cells which would normally help fight infection. Rash, children may have small, dark spots that look like common rashes if the leukemia cells spread to the skin easy bruising or bleeding. This includes frequent nosebleeds, bleeding gums and bleeding a lot from small cut bone or joint pain. This is caused by a buildup of leukemia cells near the surface of the bone or inside the joint. Swelling of the abdomen. Leukemia cells may collect in the liver and spleen causing them to enlarge. Loss of appetite and weight loss. If the spleen and liver swell, they can press against the stomach causing loss of appetite. Swollen lymph nodes. Some leukemias spread to the lymph nodes causing them to source. American Cancer Society advertisement Ashley revealed that a normal person's white cell count is 5, while adults who are suffering from the blood cancer tend to have a white cell count of 40, so it was alarming that his eyes were so hot. The star explained that being told the news left him a broken man, and he claimed it was an absolute miracle that she has been able to fight the king through publicizing his eyes battle. Ashley
Wesley has helped the NHS get 80,000 people to sign up to become stem cell donors in just 48 hours after he appealed, saying that he was forever grateful to the members of the public who had ordered test kits to be added to the stem cell register. Ashley claimed the charities usually get 30 to 40,000 people registering in a single year. Ashley who made his appeal to find a donor on social media, said he thought it was beautiful how people could come together for a good cause in spite of negativity that is often pre